Hey coach John Haskins, uh, tough 71-61 loss to Columbus State today. Uh, first of two games this weekend for you. Uh, tail two halves really for you today. Everything that went right for you in the first half sort of went the other way for you in the second. Yeah, I thought uh, I told our team I thought we were very aggressive and attacked any kind of pressure and, and attacked the basket in the first half. I thought the second half uh, we got in a very reactive mode. I thought we stood around a lot. I thought we were confused and just standing around trying to figure out what we were trying to do. Uh, you know, so we've got to we've got to get better organized, and we've got to get the ball moving and attacking. And so uh, that was very disappointing. I think we scored 20 in the second half, and uh, you know, I think with about three minutes left, we'd only had 14 or 15 points in the second half. So it was kind of like a second half uh, uh, against Augusta in terms of offensive output. Yeah, Columbus State uh, keys their victory today. 11 for 31 from three-point land. Near nearly half their points come from the perimeter. Uh, it seemed like they couldn't really miss in the first half, and they sort of toned it down in the second half and made some keys. Yeah, I thought our defense maybe was a little bit better in the second half, although statistically I don't know that it was. I think they didn't score as many points. But, uh, you know, 42 just works hard in the post, and you got to kind of help off her because she's she's catching and spinning and moving. you got to kind of dig to her, and that opens up some perimeter opportunities. And, uh, and they made some shots today. I thought we gave them some off the scouting report that uh, 12 and 22 that we wouldn't, didn't want to give looks to in the first half. I don't think we gave them as many looks in the second half. But uh, uh, they shot the ball well. They spread your defense out a little bit and they go inside the 42, and she did a good job of taking it get into the free throw line. Let's talk about some individual performances. Kier Haney, 19 points, a uh, majority of those in the first half. She looked really good shooting the ball today. Yeah, we, we attacked and got some dump downs to her, and we got some stuff off our sets with some cuts and, and got her the ball around the basket. And then she did make a couple face-up J's. Uh, again, I just don't think we got the ball where we needed to get it in the second half. And uh, uh, for whatever reason, we just weren't very assertive offensively. I was going to loop, uh, lump a couple of players in here. Amelia Parton, 13 points. Uh, just 3 of 10 shooting from the floor, though. And also Taylor Gallantin, big 8 rebounds today for yeah, her. Yeah, and Taylor does a solid job most every game uh, for us defensively and rebounding. And then uh, uh, Amelia made some shots. Uh, uh, a few shots, uh, we just didn't make enough. I thought we, we got some looks that could have got us over the hump, got some good looks from the three uh, that could have got us over the hump, and we didn't, didn't get them. And then we missed some free throws when we needed them. You know, I think uh, uh, Jasmine went up, made one or two where we could have cut it like one or two. And then, you know, when we're trying to fight back in, I think Slim went over for two uh, from the free throw line. So uh, that, that kind of hurt us also. Uh, usually luxury after loss, you get a few days to regroup and, and collect your thoughts. But uh, back on the court tomorrow against Georgia Southwestern, what what do you expect to see from the Hur Lady Hurricanes That's tomorrow? They get after you defensively. They're very athletic. They'll push the floor, uh, ball up the floor in transition, uh, attack the basket. That they can shoot the three. You know, I saw the film where they scored 97 last Saturday against. Uh, Young Harris, so it, do, it doesn't get any easier. They got some girls that can shoot the ball. They got some girls that can put it on the deck. They got some pretty good inside players, uh, and they're really going to try to uh, pressure you defensively. So you know, we just we just you know we don't have time to work on it, but we just got to be better tomorrow.